How will Void King turn back to Tarek in Power Rangers Dino Fury? This has been a question that a lot of people have been kind of asking and been kind of talking about, but now we have an official answer. Now, if you've watched episode 19 called Bad Vibes, you would have noticed something that Izzy and Javi get turned evil by the Sporex machine, or basically by a Sporex gun, which then obviously turned them evil, so that they go off and then they wreak havoc and make life painful for the Rangers much later on. There's a part in the episode where Izzy and Javi's uh, mom and dad are singing and Javi and Izzy are kind of remembering and the information of that they're going seeing their happiness breaks the spell quite easily. But since it was just a small version of the gun and not a proper Sporex machine that obviously turned uh, Tarek into Void King, what would actually happen? How will Void King turn back into Tarek? Due to international spoilers, we know that Amelia is from Rafcon. She uses her telepathy to actually uh, play the memories back for Void King, which then shatters that illusion that actually turns Void King back into Tarek. And this is kind of interesting. It's not how I would have done it, but it's, you know, we've already had the foreshadowing. We know what's going on. And I generally kind of think that they could have done this slightly better. But obviously they're going to use the same sort of thing on Void Queen, which then will split them completely different, which we've seen on set of this photo here of Void Queen and basically, I can't remember her name, but the actress who plays her. And obviously that's what we saw previously at the very beginning of season two of Dino Fury. Now, having this ability to send thoughts telepathically and stuff like that, I generally kind of think, yeah, Again, I would have had the fact that Void King would have been defeated uh, by Amelia, like the stroke of the blade or whatever, which then transforms him back because of an overloading power, and thus therefore the kind of the control dissipates. But having the ability to say, hey, here's all my love, here's all my memories, because Pop Pop gets really, really hurt, and I'm guessing he feels like, oh crap, I'm dying, and then tells Amelia everything, which then makes her go to Area 62. So seeing this, it's kind of interesting. Again, would have done things slightly different, as I kind of explained. But I feel like getting this kind of closure, getting this kind of this mystery completely told now, feels like we've now gone in the right direction, and I'm all here for it. So I'm going to leave it there. What are your thoughts? Do you like this sort of thought, or did you not like it? Let me know down below in the comments. And yeah, like, favorite, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video. チャンネル登録、高評価、お願いします。以下のリンクから商品を入手することができます。